Blackout EDC, Volume 2, V2, whatever you want to call it, let's go ahead and jump into it. And the first thing that we got to go ahead and start off with is the company who basically lives by the whole minimalist clean design. Shout out to the channel sponsor. That's going to be Kadabe with their synthesis. Now, I know there's always tons of focus, focus on the sheath. All right, the sheath is an amazing case. Don't get me wrong. But when it comes to the synthesis, a lot of you love this as well. Let me see the hashtags in the comment. Synthesis Squad. And this is going to be a good one as well. Now, first things first, this case is going to give you dead dedicated grips that goes along the side of the phone. I know a lot of people say sometimes the, the texture of the sheath can get a little bit slippery. Look, don't, don't worry about it. The census has you covered with their dedicated grips. This is going to be a much thinner case, I feel like, than the sheath, which gives you a more minimal and clean design. You get a very nice fit when it comes to it. I mean, that's kind of standard protocol. When it comes to Kadabe cases, very nice and tactile buttons. You still get that very strong mag safe. This is the case that just gets it done. If you're looking for a clean, minimal looking in case that just very minimal branding i know you don't really like a bunch of bold branding a bunch of bold you know unique designs this case is very clean and it gets the job done and also as always like kadabe products is going to be at a very affordable price so hit the links down below go grab yourself up a synthesis trust me i don't think you'll be disappointed airpods you know there's some of my favorite accessories when it comes to my whole apple ecosystem and of course we got the airpod pro 2s but what we're mostly talking about because guess what airpods isn't blacked out all right i wish they made black airpods apple Go ahead and give us some black AirPods, man. I think everybody would appreciate it. But it is going to be wrapped in the Pataka Mag Easy AirPod case. I've been finding myself using this case a little bit more because of the slim profile. And, and it also has MagSafe magnets. You know I'm a sucker for MagSafe because everything has to have MagSafe. And that's exactly what this thing does. I mean, let me go ahead and bring my charger over here. And let me go ahead and put it up to the camera and let you see it. Yeah, it does have magnets, as you can see right here. So that is just an extra little point when a airpod case has magnets that's just something extra that i love to see very thin and also when you open it up i guess i could talk about these because they are black you have the comply foam tips when it comes to your airpods i'm not sure about you but the white tips in my opinion just doesn't get it done when you're talking about the fit and i'm big on fit because i wear these half of the day especially working from home after i get off watching youtube videos and things yo go ahead and get these comply foam tips these things right here just made the fit of my airpods that much better they're cheap they're amazon you can get them on prime and get them in quickly but trust and believe once you get them in you'll see the benefit of those phone tips so the pataka case which gives you the cutouts everything that you need has those built-in magnets and then when you open it up on the airpods themselves you have your comply foam tips just a very nice combination when it comes to your airpods now, one product I almost forgot talking about it because it's over here sitting on my wrist and I almost ended the video without getting into it. This is going to be the Spigen Rugged Armor Pro for your Apple Watch Ultra. Now, this is going to be a watch and a, a band and a case combo all together. This basically is an all one type of construction. This basically makes your Apple Watch Ultra turn into a G-Shock for those who just likes that kind of look. That's exactly what this does. You have your button here on the side as you can see right here. Let me go ahead and take it off so you can get a better look at everything. So on the side, you get everything that you normally get. You get your speaker hole, you get your action button. That's very good. You get your button over here and you get the cutout for your actual dial. And you're gonna get a nice rugged look, very nice nice rugged looking band with a nice class on it so you can lock it around and this is basically an all-in-one design you pop your apple watch ultra out of your band and just slide this in this whole assembly and that's basically what you have right here so somebody who wants to kind of rugged beef up their Apple Watch Ultra, you can go out there and get the Spigen Rugged Armor Pro for it, and that's exactly what this bad boy does. It just makes it really look like a G-Shock, gives it a cool looking look. It comes in a few different colors, black and I think clear, but just want a nice little switch up for those who just wants to make their Apple Watch Ultra a little bit more extra. Now, you know we always gotta throw an external battery charger in here, and we gotta go ahead and talk about one of the most affordable battery packs out there on the market, and this is gonna be the Anchor 321. Now, I did a dedicated video about this one because this this has more technology than all of the other ones that are out there that's much more expensive. Especially one thing that haunts anchor battery packs, let's just go ahead and be real, that's going to be heat. And they have a heat management system built into their battery packs where it's always constantly checking what's going on with the actual battery pack so you can keep that heat at a 
minimum. Now, this is gonna be a 5,000 milliamp hour battery, which we already know does not get your phone from zero to 100 people. Just because it's more milliamps than your phone doesn't mean it's gonna bring your phone all the way back to 100%, but it will get your phone from around zero to mid 70-ish percent. Stays cool, you have your power button here in the middle, and you get your little lights lighting up, letting you know how much battery level that you have left in it. And also, it's just very thin. Now, one thing, if you are familiar with Anchor battery products, you're gonna know this one feels a little bit cheap. This one is made out of cheap materials, therefore that's why that price point reflects. Sitting at a little over 30 bucks, if I'm not mistaken, it might be cheaper than that, but it's gonna reflect, but guess what? This thing just works simple. Like I said in my dedicated video, if you want a battery pack, if you wanna travel with it, if you work overnight somewhere, and guess what? Just, just so happen you might misplace this, I don't think you'll be upset because you misplaced it because it's not like you went out there and spent a hundred bucks for one. Very nice strong magnet if you pair it with a case that has a decent magnet on it and it just gets the job done. Pass through charging, automatically starts charging as soon as you slap the phone up here. So I like it for 5,000 milliamp hours. I feel like this is a nice little battery pack, especially in the summertime. It's light, it's not that big. You throw this on your phone and you will be good to go if you need that extra level of juice. So Anchor, three, two, one gets it done at a very affordable price point. Now this is a product that I've been finding myself using a little bit more because sometimes when it comes to cases with kickstands on them, I'm a little picky, but there are some good ones out there that we will be talking about a little bit later on the channel. But this right here, the Pataka Magnetic Phone Ring. I know a lot of you like these little phone ring holders and I need to do a dedicated video talking about the best of these, but this for sure would be on the list because this thing right here has some strength to it. So basically what this does is it acts as if you're someone who thinks the 14 Pro Max might be a little bit too big, it might be a little bit too unwieldy in your hand. This is going to solve all of that and this gives you that extra peace of mind when you are holding on to your phone. Also, it kind of serves part as a kickstand as well. So if you're out and about, you need to kick, you know, I always like to use a kickstand on my phone. Therefore, I have all types of mounts to get it done. But when it comes to actually having it built into the phone, I don't have it with the case right now. So I find myself when I'm home, if I'm doing something, if I'm FaceTiming or something like that, pop it up, pop this. I keep this on my desk, on my office, pop this on, and it simply gets the job done. It means made out of very nice quality. The hinge, when it comes to this right here, feels really good, real sturdy. You can move this at any degree that you want, and it's going to stay right there. And it just gets the job done. They come in a few different colors, even if you have the fusion weaving color with different they have those covered as well when it comes to it. This is just gonna be your standard black as you can see here. So this is gonna be a simple phone ring. Love this little thing, been using it a lot. And let's say for an example, you just wanna keep it on your phone. You don't even wanna take it on and off. You have a phone that has a nice strong magnet. You can basically leave it on your phone and it's not gonna be that out of the way. I mean, just look at this right here. As thin as this phone case is, you can almost see it kind of matching up with the camera bump. So you can just leave this right on your phone and use it when you need it. And, and you, you can't, this. some of them kind of rotate 360, but it's the whole actual ring that's rotating. But some people like to leave it up there and then when you don't need it, just put it down, throw it in your pocket, do what you need to do. This camera, this phone ring is not going anywhere. So this is gonna be the Pataka, I was gonna say Mag Easy phone ring since everything is phone ring of theirs, but no, it's just the Pataka Mag Safe ring. It's just another option out there, especially if you're looking at something with a very strong magnet, it's gonna be clean and out of the way when you don't need it. Now, let's go ahead and talk about some MagSafe wallets because I know you guys love them out there and let's get into one of the unique MagSafe wallets out there and this is gonna be the ESR Halo Lock Find My Wallet. Okay, so I did a whole video on this right here and this is gonna be the basically one of the first, I'm not gonna say the first, which I think it might be, third party wallets who has the find my function that is built into it. So basically what that means is when you slap it on your phone and then you can leave it up here for a little bit, you take it off, it's gonna let you know, yo, you left your wallet behind. Now, one disclaimer is it's gonna be a little bit delayed, more so like you're, I'm looking around because I'm looking for my Apple MagSafe wallet. When you take that off within a minute or a few seconds, I feel like you get a notification let you know that it has been removed. This one is gonna take a couple minutes to let you know that it's been removed, but still it's not that bad. By the time, I use this right here, I take it off, set it on my desk, go pick my son up. By the time I get outside my neighborhood, I get the notification that I left it. So it's not that delayed as they say it is. They said it's a few minutes, but this is basically gonna be a combination right here, all right? This is gonna be a MagSafe wallet, and it's also gonna have the ability to store some cards right here if you wanna store some. I have my cards in my other wallet, but just picture the cards in this wallet. It's gonna be able to hold about three or four cards, not that many, but you get a few features with this, all right? You're gonna get like a little loop right here. So you get a little, I was gonna, I put my MagSafe on the screen 
the screen side. That's how you know it's early in the morning. But you can pop it up here. You can use this basically as a, just like I just showed you that Pataka ring holder, you can use this the same exact way because it has a little finger loop right here. And it also uses as a kickstand. I love these different products that has multi functions. So you can use it as a kickstand if you need be. And it has that find my feature built in. But I know some of you are like, see how in the world does it stay powered on? They basically have their own proprietary charger that you throw right here and you will be good to go. It's a little magnetic charger. You pop it on and you're good to go. And the battery lasts for a good while. I can't remember what the battery life was when it, I'll pop it on the screen down below. But this thing does last a good little bit. So don't worry about it. You don't have to charge it every single night. So this is gonna be somebody who likes to find my features who likes mag safe wallets and wants all that built into one you go ahead and check out the esr find my wallet such a nice device and when i first talked about this it was on kickstarter you don't got to worry about that anymore go on amazon it's fully funded go ahead and get you one via prime i think i can get it actually overnight in the area where i'm at staying on the wallet side if you're not a mag safe wallet person don't don't worry i got you covered all right this is going to be the trayvax original 2.0 slim metal wallet now this is something that i've kind of been using for a couple weeks now trying to see if I like the design of it because trust me it does have a unique design but one thing that I love about this wallet that a lot of thin minimalist wallets doesn't really you know cooperate with all the people like the deads out here who just has a little bit more than three or four cards some people have two cards and they're good to go I got about eight I got about seven but the thing about this one man it can hold 15 cards right here inside of this wallet and that's basically due to the little loop mechanism that they have right here basically what this does is you can see the paracord that this has going on you can basically loosen this to your liking and it's going to allow this to actually expand to where you can put more and more cars in there but if you don't have that many cars you basically can pull this and you loop it and this is how you connect it so it has a little connector around here you loop the paracord get your cards pull them out like this if you need to go ahead and get a car i tend to pull them out and then fan them out push it in there and then you rope this around the back of it and it straps right there. Now I know some of you may be like, T, that little class system can't possibly hold your cars in. Trust me, it does. I've been using it and has not came loose so far. Like this little window that you have here, you have a little witness window to let you, if you had to put your ID so you can show your face or something like that, if you have the ID card to get into work, you can put it right there, it'll show your face and you don't have to take it out of your wallet. And it's summertime, fellas, and some ladies out there, you might be out there drinking some beers, all right, just get it. I actually used this the other night up in the house. You can actually use this area as a opener, like a beer opener, so you can just use it, pop it up, and then you can pop your beer open. Just a little, you don't gotta look around. You don't gotta, you go somewhere, grab beer, go to my friend's house, asking for an opener. You ain't gotta do that. Just go ahead and use your wallet. That's what these things are used for. You also get some pry tools right here. You can kind of use it as, also as a flathead. I did that the other day. I needed a screwdriver and I actually used my wallet for the flathead area. So you can kind of use it as a utility as well. So this is gonna be the Trayvax Original 2.0 Slim Wallet. Holds up the 15 cards, has a can opener, has a belt clip, or you can use that as a money clip, has your paracord. I like this thing right here. Very very thin, is it heavy, and uh, yeah, it just has multi-use function. So definitely go check it out. And also, if you're interested in any more Trayvax wallets, man, go check them out. They makes. They make the best wallet. I need to go ahead and review them all for the channel. And the last thing to go ahead and finish off the Blackout EDC is you got to have yourself an EDC knife. Everybody needs one. You just never know when you got to open up a toy. I know some of you thought I was going somewhere else with it, but this just simply gets it done. This is going to be the Civivi Elementum. You have that nice little thumb stud right there. Stainless steel blade, drop point, plain edge. Just very simple and gets the job done. This thing was my first EDC knife that I purchased. Very light. I love it right here. You have your belt clip. They come in many different handles that you can change it out to different colors that you can rock out with it's on amazon a range about 60 you know 65 bucks so it just gets the job done i mean you can't go wrong with this i use this to open up plenty plenty of boxes i get sent tons of stuff and it's nothing like having a blade on you to just rip it open if you need to go somewhere in your son they got a restaurant you need to cut your son's straw little things all right little things like that so everybody definitely should keep a nice little blade on a man that comes in handy when you really need it and you're looking around for something to cut so that's going to be the next blackout edc i like having fun with these videos these just compiling all of my black colored <laughs> accessories i know that sounded crazy man but in this put them all in the video man so stay tuned for v3 if you want to catch v1 i'll be sure to pop that video right there